In this video, I am going to explain you about what are the types of microcontrollers available in the modern day cars as well as the old cars. So what are the uh, top few uh, ECUs that is microcontrollers have been used in the ECU. So of course you are working on uh, many ECUs, uh, many you are you may programming for many ECUs or you may testing for the many ECUs in the integration or system level testing. But really do you know what exactly the microcontroller you are using for your ECU? If you really know, yes fine, if you are not, yes just get into this channel and uh, you can just learn exactly what are all the microcontrollers and what are the architecture and how it works. Everything will be see in this playlist that is the microcontrollers in the ECU will be the playlist uh, and it will be the first tutorial on that. And uh, if you are not subscribed, you can subscribe to the channel and also if you are willing to uh, learn automotive about the system level knowledge you can subscribe to this channel the link of for this channel also given in the description this channel we have given the enough explanation like what are the components in the car and uh, how uh, once you turn on the key how the car reacts so how the key uh, you are turning on goes to the engine and what are the firing sequence in this everything has been given in this uh, channel and yes of course uh, as of now only four videos has been uploaded and uh, remaining as on the flow like the next will be on the acceleration axle act pedal accelerator pedal the next will be the brake pedal clutch gear everything all right so let's uh, get back to this tutorial ecu in cars of course you would know cars each car have certain number of ecus for your understanding and the knowledge i just wanted to share you the rough survey has been taken and if you see the year 1990 and 2000 2010 and 2020 so you can have uh, the three categories low end mid range and high end vehicles that is car i'm talking about so in the low end car so in the year of 1990 we have it starts with 5 7 like 10 and 2020 in low end vehicles itself we have around uh, 10 to 12 ecus all right so in mid range it will be have it started from some uh, 15 or 7 8 and goes to 15 then it, it goes around 35 and near to 40 and the high end that is luxury cars we have the ECUs like uh, in the 1990s so we have uh, ECUs near to 20 and now it goes around 70 to 90 as well so that is what the ECU count and uh, just the rough understanding about how uh, what are the how many ECUs will be in the cars alright so in our uh, series in the in our series of videos we'll have what are all the ECUs uh, has been in the car and what are the microcontrollers have been used and how the microcontrollers are six it's a 32 bit or 16 bit and how the memory allocation everything will be seen in our upcoming tutorials and uh, in this uh, tutorial just have a brief because you have to know that uh, if someone asks what microcontroller you are using or what are the types of uh, microcontrollers has been used in the ECUS, you are in the stage to answer for that. So for that this video has been made to make you uh, not confuse more and to make you understand short and crispy. So we have the broad five uh, top five microcontrollers has been used in the uh, today's cars. So, so that's what there are different microcontrollers. It depends on the application. So, why this microcontroller has been uh, classified? So, it depends on the application and usability of the microcontroller. All right. So, we have it starts with the A051 microcontroller. We have a Renesis. Then we have Pic microcontroller. We have Atmel AVR microcontroller. Then we have Infineon Tricore microcontroller. So, most of you may seen this Infineon Tricore microcontroller. So, definitely this would be in most of the ECUs. And uh, after this, it will you can uh, you may you might know aware of that well, AVR microcontroller. If you just uh, look in depth, you can uh, see Renesis, then uh, PIC microcontroller as well, 8051. All right, so these are all the major microcontrollers. So if anybody asks you, like, what are the microcontrollers so far can be used in the cars, yes, these are all the five. All right, so these are all just uh, images I have been given in your uh, ECU. Definitely, you can see. And if you see, you can just uh, leave the comment that what microcontroller you have seen in your ECU. It will really helpful for others to understand as yes, uh, you are using so it is better if you if you give the name of the ECU as well say for example if you are working for some airbag ECU so we can just mention like uh, Renesis has been used in the airbag ECUs or pass steering we have used the PIC uh, microcontroller for the pass steering so like that it will be really helpful for you as well as others to share the information all right just uh, don't forget to leave a comment and um, this will be continued this playlist will be continued for a series of microcontrollers and uh, how it will be really helpful 
oh, all right so if you again want to subscribe this channel you can subscribe and uh, we are about to give valuable stuff on them so thanks for your watching this channel and uh, i suppose we'll get back with uh, another interesting topic